There's a new feature called Timeline in Google Sheets. This is pretty cool and can simply show a series of dates and their names, but also I'm gonna show you one really cool thing where you can group these tasks. I'm gonna first select all of my data, cert, timeline. I'm gonna create a timeline here. I'm gonna use A through E, okay. It's going to automatically try to figure out which is the due date. If I have different dates here, I can select in the start date, due date. If I have an end date or a duration column, I can choose it here. I don't in this particular case. And if I wanna change the card title, I can change it here over on the right side. I can also say no uh, option if I want to. If I can change it to say status, that might not work very well, right? But task name here. And if I scroll down, I also see there's card color, card detail. I can add some details like the status here to see which one of these are pending or in progress. And I think the coolest part of this timeline feature is this group by column here. I can select priority. Now at the top of my timeline, I can see my high priority, medium priority, then at the bottom, my low priority tasks on this timeline view. I think this is pretty cool and a really interesting way to use Google Sheets and use the data that may already be in your Google Sheets. You just want to view it in this particular way as a timeline. Hope you enjoy this quick video to share with you this create a timeline feature. Subscribe today to Better Sheets. We're making sure you're using the most out of Google Sheets you possibly can. Get the most out of Google Sheets. Make cool automation. Subscribe today here on YouTube.